Jessica with A1C Wise here, Attainable and Sustainable Weight Loss, Blood Sugar Control, and A1C Reduction. Your Type 1 Diabetes Tip of the Week is to collect and track all the information that you possibly can. If you have followed me for any length of time, you know that I come from a place of really out of control blood sugars, not being happy with my body, and zero control over my type 1 diabetes. When I used to take my blood sugar and I would see a number that I didn't like, it used to make me get this sense of failure and depression and overwhelmment, and I just didn't know what to do, and so I refused to take my blood sugars. But then my mom and I had a really serious conversation, and she said, Jess, it's just feedback and you have to be willing to not only take that feedback but learn from that feedback if you are ever going to successfully lose weight, get tight blood sugar control, and manage your type 1 diabetes in a way that will minimize long-term complications. And that really struck me because it shifted my mentality from believing that that number was a reflection of who I was and now I got to believe that it was just information that got me to learn if what I had done previously worked or didn't work. And that's what it's really about. How is it that you can tweak and refine and find the perfect formula for you? Because the truth is, all of our bodies are a little bit different. And what exactly works perfectly for me might not be the perfect solution for you. Of course, there's core fundamentals and principles that you have to integrate on a daily basis. And that's why I would highly suggest that you use a pro program that's been proven to work for other people with type 1 diabetes, like my 12-week Type 1 to Type Awesome program. It takes the guesswork out of it. It uses fundamentals and principles to get you from point A to point B, so you can lose weight, have the body that you finally want, and finally get control over your Type 1 diabetes. But again, it starts with your willingness to look at that feedback, look at those numbers and say, okay, what is it that I can learn from this? How do I need to change my activities? How do I need to change my behaviors and my beliefs and the things that I'm doing on a daily basis so those numbers can begin to shift and reflect somebody who has control over the type 1 diabetes and is in a body that they love. So please, please, please take your life and your health seriously. Once you do, things will begin to line up and the right resources and the right people and the right actions and discipline will begin to show up for you as well. Jessica with A1C Wise. Thanks for watching and we'll see you next time.